Welcome back to another video, you lovely souls. Look, check this out. People think you can't see how they be moving. They can't fool you no more. They can't fool you no more either. They think you can't see how they be moving. When you see the truth very clearly, you can no longer be fooled. People think that you cannot see their true colors, although they sit in there and showing their true colors to you unintentionally. You always been able to see the truth in people chosen ones. There may be in a time in your life where you probably was naive and you gave people the benefit of the doubt like myself. I saw the good in them, but I choose I chose only to see the good in them, although I was still detected and seeing their dark side, seeing their shadows, able to see clearly through them. So much so where I was seeing all of my life growing up. All of what I was seeing with them is who they really were. I started what I was seeing in those people, I started seeing those people treat other people the way I saw them. And that's when I started to realize, damn, people prove themselves to me. I'm not judging these people. They are proving themselves to me. I just see clearly in the people easily. I can see people's intentions easily. I've always been able to do that even when I was in the darkness, chosen ones. I believe this is a gift that we have. People really never could just fool us. If they did, we let them fool us. We let them get into our space and run over us and get over on us and treat us the way they did. We let that happen real talk. But I bet you we ain't let that shit happen very many times you wasn't just gonna walk all over us like a doormat and i know it's challenging when it's people that you really love when it's family like you feel like you're supposed to bow down to them you you feel like they supposed to control you you know what i'm saying especially if it's uh someone in your family that's an elder like you feel like you're supposed to believe what they believe you feel like they supposed to control your life you feel like they supposed to know what's best for you like they supposed to know your life story your journey when all in nationality they do not know only you have that key baby that key to that door that's within you it's inside of your inner wisdom inside that inner genius inside of you my friends babe when you tap in turn on the tune in that person that's that inner genius that's that uh inner world within you that you tapped into that inner wisdom my friends and that's just real talk so that inner wisdom can't be fooled by nobody so when you definitely tapped into it now in today's age with a high vibration shining your light on it you definitely can see people deeply you see exactly what people are hurting. You see exactly what people are crying for help at. You see their sadness. You see why people are bitter. You see why people feel unhappy. You see everything within these people and you don't judge them. You accept them for who they are, but you can see them even when they try to fool you, bro. I know one thing. When I first came spiritual, I started feeling some type of way because in the past, like I said, people could not fool me. I always seen they true colors, my friends, and that's just real talk. I saw what other people couldn't see. I used to wonder like why such and such don't see them people like why they letting them people get close to them why they letting them come stay at their house bro are they aware of the people they letting in their life oh shit why they dating that person you know i knew all about the people these people had connections with i knew the truth about them i was wondering why they couldn't see it i'm like they don't see that and i've actually mentioned to people which is why i got labeled messy by being real but you know what i'm saying telling the truth to other people like do you see how this person's moving do you see their intentions do you kind of kind of are you able to see like what i'm seeing and they're like no i just see that they're kind you know they're really cool we have fun together and i'm like what and i started to realize people weren't able to see what i was able to see let me know down below in the comment section have you always been able to see people to, in, a, in a way that other people could not see it and now that shit just got more powerful and you see people really like trying to disrespect you right in your face low key like it's shit crazy right that's why it's important to know who you are come from love and accept people for who they are so when you come in contact with certain people that be doing this type of shit they be moving like this right tell you a joke but really talking about you think it's funny look check this out I was I uh, actually was in HEBs, right? And I had this shirt on, like, don't ask me why I'm vegan. Ask yourself why you're not, right? Because I'm a vegan and I'm a proud vegan, you feel me? And people ask you certain things from a place of not even caring, just being funny about it, right? So I was I asked the, a guy in HEB, I said, well, do you know where this uh, certain Serrano sauce is? And he was like, oh, yeah. He, first he says, I said, do you know where? He says, what are you looking for? I said, I'm looking for Serrano sauce. And he says, hold on. He says, what are you looking for? And I said, I, and he said, tuna fish. I'm like, huh? And I thought two and two together. I said, no, I ain't looking for no tuna fish. He was like, no, I'm just playing. I thought about it. I walked off with my fiance. I was like, he, he read my shirt. So he thought telling me I'm looking for tuna fish was funny, but he really making fun of the fact that I'm a vegan. <laughs> but I didn't even trip though, because I know where he is. I get where he is. And that's what people be doing, bro. They can't fool you. They think they got jokes and that shit, the jokes on them. 
You feel me? The joke's on them at the end. That joke ain't even on you. It's like, it's so crazy because you sit here and watch people try to disrespect you in your face on being slick with it. Like, you can see their character. You, they cannot fool you. And that's the same thing with they in this world. That force, it cannot fool you. You can see what it be doing to other people. You can see how it be moving in your own life. You can see how it throws things out there in your life to try to control you. And the things that it really throw out there in your life is some shit that you can attach to in the physical world. Okay, that's why I tell you guys never get attached to anything. Always the law of detachment. Let life happen through you. Okay, don't attach to anything. Okay, just let life flow through you, my friends. Because they try to get you with attachments, my friends. That's real talk. And you can see that they be trying to come for you. And you see the attacks. And you just be like, damn, bro, this is what was going on when I was asleep. Like, they was just really coming for me, throwing the tax after tax after tax at me. With this the type of shit I used to respond to? This the type of shit I used to ruin my days, weeks, months, years? This type of shit? Oh, my God, you probably sitting back laughing now like me. I sit back and laugh at all this shit because you can't be fooled no more. They only fooling they soul, but they still going to try to comfort you, even though you are aware of it, my friends. Trying to catch you slipping. Maybe you're having a more challenging day. So be mindful whenever you feel like you are tired. Be mindful when you've had a challenging day. Be mindful when your days are not as good as other days because they trying to come for you when you feeling as low as you might feel. When you feeling down because that's their chance to try to sneak in and catch you slipping because they are aware that you are aware of it. But they not going to stop, my friends. Key now is to be aware of it, okay? You may not feel good sometimes. It's okay. Still take the right inspired action toward the things that you want to move towards, okay? Don't stay focused on why you feel the way you feel don't allow those feelings to stop you you can still feel real re- feel rejection and still take action towards some things you want in your life baby okay we're always going to be dealing with different things within ourselves we're always going to be dealing with certain type of attacks we just have to learn how to stand in our power and body our energy use our superpowers to m- move through these things baby because as you can see what's going on out there in the world so they're going to keep trying to come for you because god is elevating you god is rising you up to new levels baby your your is in rooms you have not even walked in yet. You about to start walking in rooms that got your name on it because you made it where you need to make it to. But they always going to come and ta- attack you. So you are learning how to live this new way of life right now. Learning how to dodge attacks, how to get through attacks, how to recognize attacks. But I'm telling you, watch out for the times when they try to catch you slipping, my friends. Because they try to think they, think they can fool you. But they got to understand if they don't know yet that you can't be fooled no more because God has let you see everything clearly. Everything and everyone has been revealed right before your eyes. If you have not experienced this yet, keep yet. Yeah, just keep on moving forward because you are about to experience what I'm telling you right now. This shit is about to come into your awareness. You're going to start seeing it probably after you watch this video. And that's just real talk, baby. They've been trying to fool you your whole life on this planet. Everything's been fucking fake. Everything. It's been like an illusion, bro. Real talk. Reality, your reality has been created. I realized I created my reality. The, the reality I've had in the past, the, 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 the way I was living, tongue tied, trying to mess with my throat chakra, bro. I realized that my reality was created from the past for me believing shit. That I did not have to believe. And it was manifesting into my physical reality for me feeling Certain ways about myself that I did not have to feel just because I went through challenges, just because I failed sometimes, just because I fell, failed sometimes and fell on my ass sometimes, just because I went through some sadness and hurt and pain, just because I had to learn different things in my life. I had to get through issues and problems and blocks just because I experienced all that shit in my life does not determine who I am. That does not determine you, my friends. Those things happen so you can take your power back. God knew who you were and God knew what would wake you up. And this, all the things that you have to go through is for a reason. So you can know how to help those who need to get through the same shit that you've been through. A lot of you been through a whole lot of shit for a reason, baby, because you are powerful beyond measure. God knew you could get through it. 
And you're going to have a whole lot of people who ready, when they ready, who come to you, get through it too. And that's why you went through what you went through. That shit don't make you who you are. So you got some limited beliefs about yourself today. Don't believe those things no more. Believe what you want. See what you want. You have the choice every day your cells are regenerating and changes. And you can choose. You can choose another way, my friends. You can make another choice. You don't have to live the way you used to live no more. Only think of things you want only see things the way you want to see it in your life when you're co-creating my friends okay be very mindful of that you're in a new world now where you can co-create your own reality i call it co-create because i work with source i would be very selfish if i would say i do this on my own i don't do this on my own i work with god i work with the universe i work with my higher self and i have a spiritual team of the divine love and light rocking with me my angels rocking with me baby and that's just real talk i don't do this by myself and that would be selfish for me to say that and you probably know too my friends that you don't do this by yourself you a co-creator and that means a lot i'm gonna have to make a video over how you co-create so you can be aware of when it's time for you to step back and allow the universe to do its part my friend that's real talk there are things that you are learning about yourself now on this new path and you can't be fooled no more they can't fool you no more and people cannot fool you no more and i'm gonna tell you something they never really could we just gave them the benefit of the doubt. We were just being naive. We just wanted connection. We just wanted someone to love us. Sometimes we might have wanted attention because we didn't get it growing up. We wanted somebody to see us. We wanted somebody to hear the call out within ourselves like, hey, I'm a really a kind person. Hey, I'm cool. Hey, I'm funny. We wanted somebody to understand us. But you know what? Ain't nobody really ever understand us. Ain't nobody ever get any of what, what I just said to you. And that's okay. Because as long as you get why you did what you did, as long as you learn from your lessons, as long as you see why you may have wanted that attention, you know, if something happened to you as a child, you didn't get much attention. When you was a baby, you you didn't get much attention. You're going to grow up wanting attention. And when you become aware of that, that's powerful. Now you can see why you was doing what you was doing that was tied to attention. So don't be hard on yourself, my friends. Don't be hard on yourself and know and really trust and believe in yourself and know that you cannot be fooled no more. And people... People think that you can't see their true colors. People think that you can't see how they be moving, but they don't know. You see what they going to do before they even know what they going to do. I want to say that again. You see what they going to do before they even know what they going to do. You also see what they going to do before they even do it, baby, because God be showing you, bro, and that's real talk. So really accept the truth. That's key now. It sounds like simple shit, but it's challenging as hell when you in them shoes, when you in that situation, okay? When, 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 whenever you got to really just be real with yourself to somebody, like, man, you know what? I see what you're doing. I, I, you know what I'm saying? I, I forgive you for myself, but I can't really fuck with you no more. You feel me? And, and, and that's that. You know, I got, I got to cut you off, bro, and I really wish the best for you. Real talk. And you let it be, and you move along because you sit here watching people disrespect you right in your face. They think you can't see them. You're seeing people make their little jokey jokes right here in your face talking about you, talking down on you. You feel me? You see all this shit happening right in front of your face. You see how people try to get over on you. You see people how, how people try to come into your life and just use you for something that you got. You feel me? You see how people just use you for your energy just because they feel good when you come around, but they really don't even like you. You see people's true colors. The key is what you're going to do about it. Are you going to let them stay right there doing what they're doing, disrespecting you right in your face, talking to you crazy right in your face before you decide to want to react because you're going to get tired of it and get fed up with it? It's best to do it before it gets that far, my friends. It's best to just let go of the people that God is revealing to you today that does not have your best entrance. You can't be fooled no more. They can't fool you no more. And people think you can't see how they moving, bro. They think you can't see them. People really think they're invisible. And really, some people really do believe that they're invisible. There's something they may have experienced in their life that made them feel invisible when nobody paid attention to them. So they're growing up thinking they're invisible, getting away with everything. A lot of people in a child is running their life and wrecking their life because that child needs to be tend to. That child needs to be loved, accepted. And uh, work, you need to work with your inner child always so they don't run your life being reckless. How many people do you see grown still acting like kids out there? Let me know down below in the comment section. No judgment, no shade, just real shit we speaking on here, my friends. People swear you can't see how they be moving, bro. They be trying to get over on you. They be trying to take your kindness for weakness. They try to walk all over your heart, bro. They try to, like when you want a relationship, it's coming to me, man. You be having people that really be cheating on you, but trying to make you believe some other shit. Try to act like it's you. You the reason why I cheat on you 
or deny it. Oh, no, I didn't cheat on you. Why would I cheat on you? Like, you don't understand. Like, why you want to be here with me if you want to cheat, bro? Why? That's because you a chosen one, bro. You got that love and energy. They ain't going to find nobody else like you. But they got somebody else that's doing something that you just ain't going to do because you respect yourself enough. You respect yourself too much to do some shit that somebody else wants you to do. Even if they so-called love this person, okay? Even if you love this person, you're not going to do what another female might go out there and do or another male might do because you truly respect yourself. So you got to let that person go. Let them go on out there and do what they want to do because they can't have their cake and eat it too with you no more. Okay, that's not happening. So, yes, a lot's going on in your life right now because a lot of people being revealed. A lot of people that used to fool you is being shown right they true colors right there. They showing them to you unintentionally. They who've been fooling us our whole life in this matrix is being shown. The true colors of this energy, you feel me? This dark force, that energy is being shown what it's been doing to you all along. How it's been using your own power to get you to make you believe some shit that you did not have to believe in your own life and about yourself just because of what you went through. Yeah, people look at you like a failure because they don't understand your life. Because they don't understand that failure, baby, it will not defeat you, baby. You will use failure as motivation to continue to keep going, to continue to think your way through whatever it is you need to think your way through. Because you're going to get where you're going. And God going to make sure that, and you going to make sure that, my friends. So people can't fool you no more, but you got to start understanding your worth. You got to understand who you are. You really got to know that you are enough and love yourself, my friends, because some of these people that you have around you don't deserve to be around you. You're not better than them, baby, but you know what energy is. You know who you are. You're learning who you are. And you're starting to see that these people are blocking your light. They just trying to get some of your light so they can shine, baby. They got to earn that shit. They just trying to stay all up in your shit so they can shine. But they got to earn that shit like you did, baby. Okay? So you guys who are hiding your light out there, there's a message coming. You guys who are hiding your light out there, you're being so, <laughs> you're being stingy. You're being stingy with your life, baby. Get out there, baby. Spread your truth. Speak your truth. Tell your story. Don't hide your light from the world, baby. The more light we get shining, baby, you know what I'm saying? You know, dark and light is balanced. The more light we get shining out here, baby, the better, baby. There's many people waking up on this planet today. People are throwing in the towel saying, fuck this. I'm tired of this. You feel me? Same thing as you. You probably feeling like this too, my friends. Because you're tired of people thinking they can fool you. You're tired of people walking in and out of your life. You're tired of people... Uh, Blaming you for they shit. Okay? You tired of living to other people's standards. You tired of living by the perception that other people see in you. You tired of being walked over, walked all over, ran all over, and treated like you not shit, bro. Throwing you in yesterday's trash. You heard what T.I. song say? Who song was that? I'm going to ride on you and hide you in yesterday's trash. How they go? Let me know down below in the comment section. Just came to my mind. Like, they be trying to throw you to, like, you trash. Like, you ain't nothing. But then try to come running back to you. You feel me? Man, you be seeing how people moving, bro. You really got to take off the labels. You really, you see the good in people, but you also got to see all of, all of what you are seeing. You really got to accept that shit is real, bro. You seeing it. You seeing it. Yeah, you see they good, but you seeing shit that, you, you know what I'm saying, that they don't know about themselves. You seeing shit like, damn, I've been hanging around this person. Like, I, I need to cut this person off. Like, you're able to see even more deeply. You always saw it, baby. Like I said, we was being naive. Or we was just, like, giving people the benefit of the doubt, bro. Real talk. Because of things that we were taught in this matrix made us be like that. And that's real talk. And it's all good because it's all love, baby, at the end of the day. Because I still love that... Uh, that force you heard because you know what this was a powerful journey and it's continually continuously being a powerful journey god knew this taking your power back is everything it's not even about getting at the top of that mountain baby it's about the climb the way up the way you move up what you go through how you move through things how you take people out your way how you get things out your way how you overcome shit bro how you let shit go how you stay outside your comfort zone stay expanding your consciousness you feel me stay growing bigger because you have a greater purpose on this planet and you are aware that you are being unique my friends and people can't fool you no more they can't fool you no more you can see how they moving bro you always did and that's real talk man i love y'all man real talk people can't fool you no more let me know down below in the comments they can't fool me no more people can't fool me no more i see them it's like a fucking glass of water i can see straight through you you heard that's real talk you see god give us these gifts we got to use them and we got to really be honest honest with ourselves many people may not be honest with us but we gotta be honest and real with ourselves baby we have to that's key man i love y'all man if you like this video please hit that like button so we can get this video through the youtube algorithm
and reach out to more chosen ones, light workers, and star seeds. People who share equal exchange of energy. People who rocking together, understanding each other, baby. And that's real talk. And if you find that you are coming back to my videos and finding messages here, and that my videos or messages are resonating with you, consider tapping into the full awareness, love, and light that I share here with you on my channel each and every day, baby. Because I'm keeping it real, baby. Spreading that awareness, love, and light. I miss Kelly Travel spiritually. And welcome to the Pure Clarity Mindset family. On this channel, we getting our mind right. Share this video to anyone you want to share this video to and remember i'm the mind master you're the mind master i'm the alchemist you're the alchemist you're the star baby real talk you're shining so bright you're shining so bright they can see you you hear it? and you can see the darkness all around you you can see you can shine the light on any of your darkness you can shine the light on those and see them deeply even though you already always saw it now you even go deeper with it you feel me it matters. Energy matters, my friends. Remember, everything is energy. Everything. It matters. Come back to see me. Miss Kelly Travel Spiritually checking out. I love y'all, man. You always protect.